hello viewers welcome back to my channel we are still solving question of uh neko examination mass problem 2024 and we are now in question number five and then question number five said the third term the third term of of a geometric geometric progression is minus five and and the seventh and the seventh term is minus eight then i say find find the common common ratio okay solution now this is very simple what do we do you should know that that the end term of a geometric sequence or geometric progression is given by a r raised to the power n minus 1, okay? And where n is the number of terms. So, therefore, if you have the first term, the first term should be what? A, because 1 minus 1 is gone. The second term is going to be what? A r. The third term is going to be what? A r squared. There is a pattern I want to show you. But if here is 3, here will not be 2. So, what do you think if A 5 will be? A 5 should be what? Sorry, T 5 will be what? A r what? 4. That is the pattern. So, therefore, the third term here, T3, is equal to what? A R squared, which they say that is equal to what? Minus 5. Let me call it equation 1. And then the seventh term, T7. What do you think it will be normally from the formula? It will be A R raised to power what? 6. Okay? And it should be equal to what? Minus 80. Now, let's call it equation 2. Okay? Now, let's say divide equation 2 by equation 1. Divide divide equation 2 by equation 1, which means a r raised to power 6 divided by a r raised to power 2 is equal to minus 80 divided by minus 5. Now, a divided by a is 1. So according to indices, this is going to be r raised to power 6 minus 2. According to indices, indices say that if the base are the same thing, we can subtract the power is equal to now 80 divided by 5 should give us what 80 80 by 5 i'm having 16 so 16 so now this is going to be what r raised power 4 is equal to what 16 so therefore r raised power 4 will be what 2 raised power 4 how did i get 2 raised power 4 share it by lcm 16 2 divide 8 2 divide 4 2 divide 2 2 divide 1. I am dividing with 2 and they are 4 in number. So that's how I got 2 raised power 4. So if you look at this, 4 will take care of 4. Automatically, the radius they say we should find is now 2. Okay? So the answer to this question is 2. Now, maybe they ask you to find the first term. To find the first term now is to substitute in any of the question, in any of the equation. So we can say substitute, substitute, R to be equal to 2 in equation 1 so that we can get a though they didn't say we should find it here i'm just trying to show you in case of necessity so i'm having that what a r squared is equal to minus 5 so what do we have a then r is 2 squared is equal to what minus 5 2 squared is 4 4 times this is what 4 a is equal to minus 5 therefore my a is now what minus 5 over 4 so that is the first term of the geometric sequence so that is that. So they can ask you to find the nth term of the geometric sequence. To find the nth term of this geometric sequence is for you to use your formula. And the formula says that tn is equal to a r raised to power what? n minus 1, which is what? Minus 5 over 4. Okay. Then I'm having my r to be what? 2 raised to power what? Raised to power what? n minus 1. Okay. This can further be broken down as I'm still showing you some things they can ask you. This can still be broken down as what? Minus 5 in bracket of 1 over 4. Then, then 2 raised power what? N minus 1. This time, this is giving us this. Okay? So, this can be what? Minus 5 in bracket of 1 over 2 raised power 2. Right? Then, 2 raised power N minus 1. So, I'm having minus 5. Now, if this one wants to come up, I'm going to have in bracket of 2 raised power what? Minus 2. Then, times... 2 raised to the power n minus 1. So this is now what? Minus 5 into 
according to indices, 2 raised power minus 2 plus n minus 1. So, which is what? Minus 5 into 2 raised power. This and this will give us minus 3. So, n minus 3. So, this is the nth term of this geometric sequence. Alright? So, thank you very much for watching this video. Please don't forget to like our video, comment, and subscribe if you are new to this channel. May the peace of the Lord be with you.